Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Nick and today the time has come. Marvel's What If episode five and I can see it in the title. We're getting Marvel zombies. I mean, I like horror. I like Marvel. Marvel zombies. I don't even have much more to say other than I am really excited. So before we get into the video, make sure to like, comment, and hit the notification button so that you can get alerts when I upload a new video. And let's watch. I am so excited. Eyeballs to entrails. I am so excited. Come. He's come. Uh, hello? Anyone got any clothes? Um, what the hell? Oh, God. That's the soundtrack from Aliens. Listen, listen, listen. What if? Aliens. Oh, we called him Iron Man. Wait, what do you guys? That's. Uh, that sort of seems like overkill. Are they zombies already? Oh my. What made them zombies, though? <laughs> I love Mark Ruffalo's voice. Oh shit! Oh, no. oh, I gotta bob. I'm definitely gonna bob. Go! You'll be safe with them. <gasps> yes! Don't eat me! Don't eat me! Don't hey, eat me! Relax. I'm just your friendly neighborhood Spider-Man. Oh yeah? Well then, what the hell happened to the neighborhood? It's Spider-Man. Okay, compose myself. Compose myself. Janet Van Dyne contracted a quantum virus that corrupted her brain. Oof. That happened. Well, that ain't good. Within 24 hours, the entire Pacific Northwest was infected. Ironically, it was the... No, you stay away from Captain America. You stay away from him. Damn it! Oh! Because once Earth's mightiest hero I mean, I'm just saying, like, if I was a zombie and I wanted a snack, Captain America would be the first person I'd eat. New York, home of the Mets, the Chrysler Building, those ladies from Sex in the City, and now the zombie apocalypse! If you can make it here, you can make it anywhere. But first, you have to not get eaten. I love Peter Parker. <laughs> Sleeves. Do I really have to be wearing this? Here I come, bad zombie. Oh my god. This is everything. IG. Zombies are attracted to the smell of human flesh, so the less pheromones you give off, the better. Nico Jack. <laughs> okay. Ooh. Bucky. This, this, this episode is a lot for me, okay? Showing Dr. Banner the orientation video. General Okoye. Yes! Wakandan Royal Guard. A beacon just came in over the wires. Oh, that's awesome. The beacon's location was corrupted in transit. We have no idea where it came from. Well, it looks to me like your message is in nonlinear hexacode. Oh, sure. A nonlinear lexicode hexac. Yeah, of course. I thought you were an Uber driver. No, no, I'm a personal chauffeur. There's a difference. <laughs> All right, everybody. Uh, splitting up. Do you guys just not have horror movies in Wakanda? Peter Parker, me. Goes the dynamite. That was solid burn on Speaking all sense. sense. That's why you watch horror movie kids because it'll keep you alive. Was that Falcon? Slash Captain America now, I suppose. Are you saying slam? 
was, eh? <laughs> <laughs> oh no, not happy! I am dead at him saying blam. Okoye is really that bitch. That was your friend. Sorry about that. I should be sad, but I'm not. Let's go. Okay, come on, guys. I think I have about 4,000 pounds of thrust here. Hang in there, Peter. They're almost here. Okay, get ready to disengage the brake. On my mark. Oh my god, no, 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 no. Oh, thank god. Look, I already lost Cap. I will riot if I lose Peter. We did it. Destination Camp Lehigh. And just like that, it became Train to Basan. Think you've had enough, Cap. No! They didn't have to do him like that. This is too much. Heart rates elevated, temperatures not going in the right direction. Then we both know what you have to do. No, not when we could be minutes away from a cure. Uh, can we really take that risk? Well, just take her like wasp suit off of her. Then she's just a normal human. We practice, I guess. My mom, dad, Uncle Ben, Mr. Stark. Oh my God, they mentioned Uncle Ben. Oh, come on, Hope. It's not your fault. I was so obsessed with bringing my mom back that I never considered what I might bring back with her. That's true. I mean, we just saw what happened with Strange trying to get Christine back. I mean, why didn't she just do that before? She could have just put him in her hand and ran there. Oh, well. Are they biting her ass? No, oh no. I totally just jump scared you. I'm so sorry. I didn't mean to do that. This is Spider Boy. Come on. Oh my god. Oh. oh, vision. You're a vision. Oh my god. It emits a subfrequency that is not to their liking. Could that mean the infection is some kind of encephalopathy? Brain stuff. Oh, what? what? Wait, who said that? It was that ghost. Oh, damn it. Hey, would somebody turn me around? We messed up my entrance. You know, I need to get this thing motorized. Oh, my God. I know what you're thinking. I've lost weight. Thank you for noticing. It's like in Mars Attacks. <laughs> Where is Wanda? Oh, no. Oh, my God. I cannot with Paul Rudd. But I cannot bring myself to leave her. What? Oh. Nice save, big guy. Oh, thank God. I think I can buy you guys some time. Dr. Banner, no, we are not leaving you. I just, I, I really, I don't think I can lose another friend today. Avenger. What is he about to do? Oh, yes. I love that Paul Rudd has Dr. Strange's cape on. Peter, spitting facts as usual. Oh, shit. Was that Bruce? In my culture, death is not the end. They are still with us. As long as we do not forget them. Oh, Chadwick. 
even if it might bring an end to the universe. Oh, f Marvel's What If, episode five, zombies. Okay, number one, that was my favorite episode. Number two, that was awesome. Paul Rudd was everything. Peter Parker, as usual, spitting the horror movie facts, was everything. You know, I'm real, real sad. I'm real sad that my boy Cap had to die. But we saw Bucky in the shower. Th oh, this was everything. This was this was a phenomenally written episode. Oh, the humor was on point. It even got a jump scare out of me. I will see you guys next time. I have to go rewatch this episode like 37 times and call everybody that I have ever met right now. Excuse me, I have to call everyone I have ever met right now.